Today we got a short video about a long drink that you should probably avoid. Hey there, NJRoot22.com here with another little quick product review of a booze drink called the long drink or the long version of that long drink name is the Finnish long drink legend of 1952 and they're getting they're getting a big it's a gin based drink and I thought it was a uh, like a seltzer because we saw this uh, at a local liquor store and it's oh zero sugar and then you look on the side and it says there's some little chart here servicing facts not even nutrition facts it says zero carbohydrates I'm like oh let me buy this this will be great and they had another can which looked exactly the same and I thought maybe that they uh, it was just some weird marketing thing I couldn't really you can't read it really understand it at you know on quick glance what's going on this is a sugary based drinks they don't list ingredients or nutrition facts like calories or or carbs or anything like that uh, I bought them anyway I was like in a hurry so I bought them um, and I didn't drink them as you can see and I'm not gonna drink them someone in my family will, might drink this if they're desperate uh, this one we're gonna probably throw out or try and return to the store it says uh, gin with a natural grapefruit and juniper berry flavor flavors and artificial sweetener and I'm thinking oh, maybe it is a erythritol even though those are natural sweeteners um, I went on their website didn't uh, list anything it just shows their social media accounts and all these fancy images and marketing that's what goes into any new product these days they have to make it look all great and make people people feel great for drinking it and they probably uh, donated this to hundreds or if not thousands of influencers online to make it seem like such a great thing I've never tasted it and never will but um, so they don't list any ingredients or any th anything on their website either I'm like that that's extremely suspicious any time a business does that it's a warning sign and it's a red flag you should avoid them at that point I should have just stopped looking uh, because I don't like when companies do that they're not transparent I went on I scoured their stupid social media I hate going on social media and someone asked well what kind of sweetener is it and they write back sucralose and that basically closed the door on this uh, company uh, because sucralose is one of the worst artificial sweeteners just like aspartame or um, any one of those saccharins um, sucralose uh, also makes you feel hungry after you consume it and I've read articles that say that they uh, are associated with diabetes they're just not a not a not a good drink uh, uh, artificial sweetener to have so this one bad artificial sweetener even though it's low zero carb and this one God knows what could be more carbs and calories than a can of soda so we'll stick to our seltzers and they're expensive too by the way three bucks a can whereas these natural lights which I've been drinking lately they're six percent uh, alcohol and only three grams of carbs these are these are pretty good they're a buck a can so that's it. Avoid the long drink and have a good week ahead.